hello guys welcome to the channel and today we have this beautiful um functional equation so we are giving this one here okay f of x plus 4 over x minus 4 equals to this and then we have to find f of x okay guys so um let's do something really beautiful guys um let's say from here we want to find for instance f of x okay the value we're going to get here has to be the same value when we find the original function which is f of x okay so let's find here f f of zero right so to have f of zero here x has to be negative four right so if x is equal when x is negative four so we're gonna have here f of uh, minus four plus four right divided by minus four minus four and then this is equals to we're gonna have this 5 times minus 4 to the power of 2 minus 24 times minus 4 plus 80 right and then from here we have 3 times um, minus 4 square and minus 4 which multiplies mi minus 40 which multiplies minus 4 plus 48 right and then from here guys this is what this is minus 4 plus 4 this is this is 0 right 0 divided by minus 8 it's 0 so we have f of 0 equals to 5 times 16 this is 80 right plus here this is 96 right plus 80 and then this divided by 3 times 16 this is 48 and then this is going to be plus 160 plus 48 okay so look at this guy this one plus this one we get what we get then 96 uh, let's do this this 96 plus 160 right and here this plus this this is 96 plus 160 these numbers are the same so we have here 256 256 and then this is equal 1 okay so guys let me write this one correctly um, we have then 1 so it means guy, guys that when we find our f of x when we reply f when we, we reply x uh, being zero we have to find the same one here okay guys so now let's start solving our functional equation so we're gonna pick this term here and we're gonna make a substitution right let's say this one here is equals to a okay now let's say then that um, x plus 4 divided by x minus 4 is equal to a so let's make this substitution because we don't want to work with this big term here uh, this is going to be kind of complicated to solve i mean um because we're going to have like a very big expression here okay so let's make substitution here guys um so um let's find then x when this this term here is equal to a so finding common denominator this one goes there multiply we're gonna have then x plus 4 equals a which multiply x minus 4 right so this is then x plus 4 which is equal to a x minus 4 a um, and then from here we have then 4 plus 4 a equals to a x minus x so we have then 4 um, uh, which multiplies 1 plus a equals to um, x which multiplies a minus 1 right and then from here we have that our x right x is equal to um, 4 right which multiplies I'm gonna write this as a plus 1 okay divided by a minus 1 okay guys so this is then uh, our substitution here so considering this substitution here guys now let's take this one and substitute in our original equation right so which is this one here so now we have um, f of a right because this is now a is going to be equal to this one here so let's replace all terms here 5x squared which is then 5 times which is x now x in terms of a is this one here okay so we have then x 5 which multiplies 4 which multiplies um, 
a plus one over um, let me say this um, this is gonna be five times four which multiplies a plus one over a minus one right um, all to the power of uh, all to the power of two right and then uh, guys we have space right we don't have to fight for space here let me write this down here so we're gonna have then f of a is gonna be equals to um, 5 which multiplies um, 4 which multiplies a plus 1 right let me say actually a plus 1 which multiplies a plus 1 over a minus 1 right um, all to the power of 2 minus 24 which multiplies 4 times a plus 1 over a minus 1 right plus 80 right we just replacing these values of x here now in the denominator we have um, 3 times the same thing right 4 which multiplies a plus 1 a minus 1 all to the power of 2 right minus 40 times 4 a plus 1 divided by a minus 1 plus um, 80 sorry plus 48 right plus uh, 48 48 so this is 48 right guys okay we have 48 here so now instead of being writing this um, this fraction all the times let's say then our, let's solve for our denominator which we're gonna call 1 and our denominator we're gonna call Okay, and then for our numerator, we're gonna have then one here. Let's simplify this, okay, guys. So this is gonna be right. This is five times four square, which is sixteen, which multiplies a plus one square divided by a plus a minus one square minus this is ninety six, right? Which multiplies a plus one divided by a minus one, okay? and then plus 80 okay finding a common denominator here we're gonna have here we have to multiply this for by a minus 1 and this one by a minus 1 square to ha have, the, have the same denominator so we're gonna have then that this is gonna be this time this we're gonna have 80 which multiplies a plus 1 square right and then this one, this is going to be minus 96, which multiplies a plus 1, which multiplies a minus 1, right? And then plus 80, which, sorry, plus, and then plus 80, which multiplies a minus 1 squared. And all this term here, all these terms here, divided by a minus 1 squared, right? Because this is the common denominator here. So simplifying this, guys, um, we have then that you see, 80 here and 80 here. Okay, cool. Now we're gonna factor 80, and then we're gonna have a plus one square plus a minus one square. Okay, and then minus 96, which multiplies this, which is a square minus one. Okay, um, all divided by right all divided by a minus 1 square and then we're gonna have here th this is gonna be 80 which multiplies this one here is a square plus 2a plus 1 plus this one a square minus 2a plus 1 minus here we're gonna have 96 a square right plus 96 and then all divided by a minus 1 square and then from here we have then that this is gonna be uh, we're gonna cancel this one and this one we have then 2a square plus 2 right and then we have 80 uh, which multiplies 2a square plus 2 sorry plus 2 and then now uh, minus 96 a square plus 96 right please guys subscribe to the channel and write in the comment how you proceed to solve this um, functional equation okay so now from here guys we have then this is gonna be a hundred and sixty 
a square plus 160 right minus 96 a square plus 96 all divided by 8 minus 1 right square okay cool and then from here we have that this is going to be equals to um, 160 minus 90 uh, minus 96 right this is going to be 64 64 a square plus this one plus this one this is going to be um, this is going to be um, this is going to be 256 okay guys all divided by 8 minus 1 to the power of 2 okay so this is our first case which is our denominator so we have simplified our I mean our numerator okay now let's simplify our denominator so following the same steps okay guys so for the second case which is our denominator we're gonna have then we have three times right uh, this one here right um, so we have three times 16 right we have then um, three times 16 which multiplies a plus 1 square divided by 8 minus 1 square minus 40 uh, times times 4 right which multiplies 8 plus 1 over 8 minus 1 right plus 48 okay following the same steps guys I'm going to solve this one quickly because this is similar to the to the first to the, the to the numerator so this is going to be 48 right and then here we're going to have 48 which multiplies 8 plus 1 square and then this one here finding the common denominator we're going to have plus 48 which multiplies 8 minus 1 square okay and then minus this one here which is going to be 100 minus 160 right minus 160 um, a square minus 1 okay it's just following the same steps and all divided by a minus 1 square okay let's put these parentheses here so simplifying these guys we're gonna have this that this is 48 which multiplies a square here right plus 2a plus 1 plus 2a right 2a plus 1 plus a squared minus 2a plus 1 right minus 160 a squared plus 160 and then this all divided by 8 minus 1 right this all divided by sorry this all divided by oh my god this is all divided by this video is gonna get kind of long guys but uh, there is there is nothing I can do about it okay you can accelerate the video put and velocity 2 or speed 2 right okay cool then from here we're gonna cancel these terms and then we have 2 a square plus 2 and then multiplying 48 times 2 we're gonna have 96 a square plus um, 96 right minus 160 a square plus 160 right all divided by 8 minus 1 square right so from here we're gonna have then this is gonna be 160 plus this one here plus 96 we're gonna have 256 and 96 minus 160 we're gonna have minus 64 a square okay guys and all divided by a minus 1 the power of 2 so guys this is our denominator so now let's let's write f of f of a in terms of what we have reduced it this this fraction this fraction here to. okay so our numerator gave us this one here okay so we have then um, 64 right well let's say 256 256 plus 64 a square divided by 8 minus 1 to the power of 2 over this one here 256 minus 64 a square divided by 8 minus 1 square okay cool 
guys this is now beautiful right because um, we can just simplify right we can just simplify this one here with this one here okay so from here then we're gonna have um, that this is gonna be equals to um, 2 5 6 plus 64 a square over 2 5 um, 6 minus 64 a square okay so our f of a right f of a is going to be equals to let's simplify this by 64 we're going to have here 64 which multiplies 4 plus a square and then here we're going to have 64 which multiplies 4 minus a square get done with this two and then we have f of a equals to 4 plus a square divided by 4 minus a square so let's get him back to our substitution here because we said we substitute a for x here so now we're gonna have that where we have a we're gonna pl place x okay our original equation so we're gonna have then that let me change the color here that f of x is equals to uh, f of x is equals to 4 right plus x square divided by 4 minus x square okay guys so this is our f of x this is our answer but remember that we said we plug here x of mi minus 4 here and we get f of 0 equals 1 okay so now let's let's do the same thing here okay let's say then that f of x here let's find f x of f of x here right so f of 0 from here now from our original original equation we're gonna have then f uh, it's gonna be equal to 4 plus um, 0 square divided by 4 minus 0 square we're gonna have then f of 0 is gonna be equals to 4 divided by 4 and we have that f of 0 is equals to 1 so this is correct guys so our final answer is this one guys f of x is equals to 4 plus x squared divided by 4 minus x squared i hope you enjoyed the video guys please subscribe to the channel and uh, like the video subscribe and comment thank you very much see you next video bye bye